SMT Nation, we back. Nation, we got a news story out of AT&T. A Georgia uh, employee, former employee, I guess, is suing AT&T for discrimination. Uh, let's discuss the news. Let me give you guys what's going on in this update. In today's video, I'll be sure to link the Atlanta News First article that'll be posted in the description. Ways to support the SMT can be found there as well. All right, so a Georgia woman is suing her former employee, or excuse me, employer of almost 20 years after saying that she was fired for coming out as transgender. According to the lawsuit, Robin Casayas spent 16 years working for AT&T as Robert Lott, a married father of three. In 2017, Casayas came out of as, as a transgender during a public meeting. In the lawsuit, it claims her workload was significantly decreased. She was bounced around from team to team before eventually being fired in July of 2020. Uh, at one point, co-workers told her a meeting in Dallas had been canceled at the last minute, only to learn it had gone on without her. There are a bunch of different events that led to some suspicion that something was going on. Uh, the lawsuit is valued at $3 million dollars. A spokesperson from AT&T uh, did release a statement saying they do not condone discrimination. The quote, we do not discriminate, nor do we tolerate discrimination of any kind, including based on individual's gender, gender identity, or sexual orientation. Uh, the lawsuit, I think, is actually, there's like a picture of the lawsuit and the complaint. Uh, so that can be accessed here through the website article as well. So that's that's a three million dollar lawsuit people comment down below you all the voice of the people the smt nation let your voice be heard